I wanted to give you guys another um, bit of footage of the queen bee. Um, you can see her right there. You can see her court around her and she looks like she's just sitting there. What is she doing? She's, where is she? There she is. Um, she's being cleaned maybe. She's not being fed, no truffle access. She's not laying. She's moving, that's good. Um, trying to check out her anatomy. Sorry, I keep moving it away from her. I'm not sure what she's doing. Maybe she's taking a break. Um, this area is full of brood and young eggs, so maybe something's going on. I do see maybe some cleaning of her abdomen. I'm not really sure. Never really seen a queen just kind of chill. Um, so I guess I'm kind of concerned, but she still looks healthy. Um, not sure what to think about that. Get a side view of her. There's a lot of glare. There we go. She's moving. I wonder what the deal is. I was just getting ready to turn the observation hive around to see um, how our little resident hive beetles are doing, but I'm not sure what is happening. Hmm. Oh, she's moving now a little bit. Trying to reduce the glare. Mm. So I'm just gonna keep filming her a bit just to see what happens because I'm not sure what's going on with her. She's not shivering, but she's kind of wavering back and forth a bit. happening. Hmm. I think my camera has macro option, but I haven't learned that yet. So, can I zoom? I can zoom. Cool. Ah, she's being fed now. Okay. Okay, that's good. Okay, so that is a little more comforting. So she is, in fact, receiving trophallaxis now. That's pretty good. That's some good footage. So I'm just going to let you watch and not talk too much. I don't have anything to say. Oh, checking a cell now? Indeed she is. So, she was just taking a little respite. Is that a word? Respite? Yeah. So now she's uh, back to work. She was just hungry. She's laying right where she was, actually. Pretty cool. I was getting concerned, but she seems to be just fine. So I'll just let you see her lay a little bit more because that's always a treat to see the queen. Especially if you don't own an observation hive, which most don't.
wonder if I can zoom from far away. Nah, why bother? I don't want to mess it up. Looks like she's being fed again. I've seen the little antennae fluttering back and forth with her. It's really cute. See, they put some burr comb there on the glass. I just put the feeder up top there and I put a little bit of honey bee healthy in there. We obviously aren't going to take any honey frames from this uh, observation hive so I can give them supplements and not have to worry about that. Even though honey bee healthy actually I believe is just essential oils like spearmint and other super things like that. So it's not really a health risk but generally you don't um, take the honey after you feed them. Uh, even if it's just sugar syrup because, well, because. <laughs> but especially if you put additives in there, then you run the risk of you um, coming in t contact with the additives. So you can see she's at the bottom of the frame now. This is the second frame up, or I'm sorry, the third frame up, second from the top. So, pretty cool. So let me see if I can get a little sound. This is one of the vents. You can see it's like a jail. But they can go out the other end. She's still here? Let's see. Can you find her before I do? Oh, there she is. So if you found her, good job. And there she is laying again. So, it's it was 70 something today. And you can see the bees are flying a lot. Coming in through their little entrance right through here. Got our nice Urban Green Bee logo. In through there and up. It's in down here. You can probably try to get out of that spot. And they all kind of hang out around the bottom. There's a lot of chaos going on down here. And this was the frame she was on. Let's see if we can see her one more time before I end the video. Ah, oh, there she is. That's pretty cool. Thanks for watching.